Hey, what's up, gamers? This is Skeletal Mystic. Welcome back to Baby Omega Pet Training. The Soulful Knight. In the last episode, I trained this knight up to adult, and he got a couple of nice resists. And I'm kind of <laughs> interested to see what other resists he might have, because I think, as I think I said before, this would make a great Darkmoor pet if he has a bunch of resists. So I'm going to go ahead and get started with it and see what happens. Okay, I am back. He's got just a couple more trainings to make it to Ancient. What I'm thinking so far is that... Well, let me pick my castle first. Um, I'll do Fortress this time. I haven't done it in a while. What I'm thinking is if he keeps getting resists like this, that he will be an excellent... Especially if he gets a Storm Resist, he will be an excellent, excellent Darkmoor pet. I mean... Doing the great, the final run for Darkmoor there can be a pain in the butt without, without, you know, the inability to shield. I think that if he resists Storm, I'm going to use him for my Darkmoor pet. Because Shane's a pain in the tail. I'm, I, oh, that was a nice hit. Look at that. Clean it all out. Anyway, Shane's a pain in the tail, as you know, with that whole not being able to feign him. And not real. I mean, all of them have pierce like crazy. I think I might use this pet for a Darkmoor pet if he keeps getting resists like this. Let's see, you made it to 460. And I can, at this point, it doesn't really matter what I feed him. As long as it's a mega. There we go. And I'll pick another one. But yeah, I was thinking that being as he. I mean, he dropped in Darkmoor, so that's kind of like your first clue. Sure, he's not the only pet that drops in Darkmoor. But this is the best one I've seen drop from Darkmoor so far. I did the Hunter's Hound already. Excuse me. And a couple of other pets. Oh, uh, Castle this time. But I haven't seen a pet as good as this one for resist. I mean, they've had all kinds of different talents. You know how it goes all over the board. But nothing that goes resist, resist, resist. Uh, and I like that. I'm really seeing this shape up to be a pet that I'm going to keep for regular use. Let's see, 10 miles an hour. At this distance, about two, maybe three clicks over the fire. Back that way, about there. That's close. Right on the money, maybe? Yep, it is. Right on the money. Almost got all of it in one shot. Almost. That was not a bad shot for the whole, for the mark. So let's see, it over there, it over there, and one, two. Ordinarily I say click for five miles an hour, but given the distance that it has to travel, I'm gonna go with three clicks. There we go, right on, right on the money. And that's what it takes to win this thing. Just as a side note, just practice and a good eye and knowing what your distances are gonna be and what your velocities are gonna be. That's really a trick to doing any one of these castles. Alright, crab apples this time. Okay, what's this? Life assailant. He got <laughs> life critical, so this is this would be a life pet. I mean a life player's pet. I was kinda hoping for some more resist. And I don't have a life character at the moment, but that's alright. We still got a couple more talents. Maybe he'll get a couple more resists. I'd love to get a storm resist on this pet. Okay, I'm gonna play again a couple rounds into his ancient, and then I'll cut back out again until he gets to mega. I'll probably run him to mega in this video. Uh, no, I'll run it. No, I'm sorry. I'll run him to epic in this video, and then I'll run him to mega in the last one. I don't really want to do all of them in one video. Makes for a 30 or 35 minute video. It gets kind of long for my my liking of making videos, and probably for you, you guys liking of watching a lot of them. Let's see. 19 miles an hour. Blah, blah, blah. As they say, bada bing, bada boom. <laughs> nice. And a couple down because I'll fly over otherwise. Three even.
and even one more down for their little short soldier here. I almost missed him, wow. Okay, 17. Let me... Let's go with Palace for one time. That sounds good. <laughs> this is that big... Gee, money! They are not lying. Look at all those blocks. Wow. <laughs> it's Lego's gone mad. Wow. All right, if I can hit those red ones in the center there, that's what I'm shooting for. If I can hit those red ones in the center... I'm gonna have to have a little bit of elevation too because it's gotta hit really it's gotta hit really high. Looking about there. I need to hit that I'm trying to hit that right hand red block back there. I'm wanting to go about three, I'm thinking. This is total guesswork on this. I've never done this particular one before. No, it's gonna be way low. Okay, I gotta go way high. The the trajectory is right, but the elevation is way wrong. This is going to take a big shot. This is, I've never gone this high. That's one, two, three, five marks up. Wow. And that'll be on the money, though. Nice. A one shot. Look at that. Nice. Oh, oh look, like a rob me on that steel block. Look. Oh, what a rob. Come on, guys. That's just wrong. The thing's laying sideways. You guys are killing me. Okay, I do not need that much elevation anymore. One, two, three. Let's try this. That's just wrong. Look at that block laying on the side. Okay, I've got to go up one more to get that. Come on. that's Oh, I should have that. Poor old knight's flying for like half an hour before he gets there. <laughs> Non-stop to the other end of the shooting range. Fight so long he has to be served a meal. <laughs> but I'm bum. Anyway. Okay, let's give him the dragon melon this time, just for as a change of pace. I've developed a little bit of lag. I guess that flight killed him. <laughs> Alright, finished. I will come back whenever he's just about to hit epic. And I am back. Our knight is just about to hit Mega. Let me see here. Let's see what he got so far. That's where he's at. So we got a couple more trainings and he'll hit Mega. I'm kind of hoping, I took a look at this and this ultra rare right here is supposed to be Myth Resist. I was hoping for storm resist but i don't think this pet has that probably be half to be mixed or added into it later on but i do like the death and balance resist it already has i mean balance psh, there's only tower shield for that as it is any kind of resistance will always help you all right let me go ahead and train him up and see what he gets for his oh excuse me see what he gets for his epic level I've been doing these same first level towers so often I can almost close my eyes once I see what tower it is and aim the thing. Just about, I must have done this a million times. To where I've got it down to a pretty much science. One, maybe two shots, three shots in the extreme and it's over with. So at least the training goes pretty fast. But as I know you guys know, <laughs> when you train a pet from baby all the way up to mega, it's quite an operation. All right, let's see what we get here. Oh, 950. Okay, so yeah, the next training should do it for him. <laughs> I got the gobbler with the roller again. This one's pretty simple too. This fortress is, or keep, or whatever they want to call it, is pretty simple. 
Sometimes I've seen where I've cleared it all the way out, but a lot of times it kills the castle and leaves those three guys in the front. And, oh, uh, yeah, that's what we have done this time. Every once in a while, those blocks will come forward and knock out these little statue gobblers guys in the front, but not all the time. I wish I could find the exact shot. Oops, went over his head. Oh, no, I got him. I thought he was going to go over his head. I wish I could find the exact shot to clear them all out every time like I have with some of these other castles. It'd be nice. Yeah. And pop, pop. Well, this one's a four-shotter just because of those just because of those little cutouts that stand up there. Yeah. Okay, this is the one. The long-awaited event. The epic level to see what he gets. Crabapple. And he should like, was it 979, 80, right? Oh yeah, okay. So I'll even go five over. I need to, on his next training off camera, train this intellect up. I noticed that it and the will are really, really low where the others are maxed out. So I'll probably find some snacks that have high intellect and high will. Dude. I always want to finish the pet up, max and all these uh, strength intellect things all the way up. Anyway. Powerful, which gives you 65. Well, I've often wondered what these talents are even really good for. Great, he gets 65 plus 65 max power. What does it do for you? And he liked that snap. I didn't like it very much. I wanted a different talent. All right, so I'll train him up a couple more past this level, and then I'll cut back out again for the final run to Mega. Corner, it should be. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Look how that, oh, it rattled and shook back there. There we go. I was wondering if it's gonna fall or not. See, now this time it only left me with the right hand statue, which it doesn't ordinarily do. It's just weird how these various directions and wind affect it so, so much. You wouldn't think so at that, at that close of a distance, but sometimes they do. Not improved. Do you have any high intellect or high will? That's a five. I like that. There's, there's a high intellect. I'll train him with that one. Boost them up some. Get that maxed out before we get to the, or the mega level. And one more. I'll do one more on camera and then I'll work him up off. And all the way up. At least, it's, at least this wind's a forward wind or pretty much forward wind. Now, nah, right about there. Those side to sides with that much velocity can really tear you up. There you go. That's about where you want to hit to, to do the double fire blocks. <laughs> blocks flying everywhere, and that, <laughs> that little gobbler had a lucky day. Nothing hit him. That's about where you want to hit to hit that double fire block and do a lot of damage to the, everything. All right, cleared up. And we will do. That's a six. That's a six, but it has three will as well. So I think I'll do that one. Okay, let me come over here and do a nice outro do it right. Okay right, guys, in the next video we'll bring him all the way up to Mega, but for now I am done. He is at Epic and you have seen the talents that he got. He got the two resists, he got the life critical, <laughs> and then he got that funky power boost thing, which I don't even know what good it is. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Maybe leave me a comment about other games or other series you'd like for me to play. If you want, Leave a comment to talk to me <laughs> or to ask me questions because I love to talk to you guys back. This is Skeleton Mystic reminding you that whatever else you do, always love the game. Peace. Hey, what's up, gamers? This is Skeleton Mystic. Welcome back to Pet Training Baby Chimega, the Soulful Knight. This is part three and the 
clip where I'm going to bring him finally at last up to Mega. As you know in the last video, I brought him up to Epic and he was getting talents that